Welcome back to the Road Show. From the front steps of Rhode Island homes to the dinner tables of those who need it the most. Boy Scouts and Cub Scouts collected more than 200,000 pounds of food this weekend, all to help fill pantries and soup kitchens across the state. Daniel North has more. They are stacking, <laughs> taping, and filling boxes full of food. Close to 8,000 Cub Scouts and Boy Scouts fed out across neighborhoods across the state, picking up donations for their annual Scouting for Food Drive. So this month we expect to help over 55,000 people. It's a record number. And so many of the people who are helping are families with children. So these kids are truly helping other kids. And with thousands of Rhode Islanders out of work as well, and with winter on its way, the need for food is still great. The Scouting for Food event is the largest food drive in New England. And some of these scouts have been collecting cans and other items every year for the past 10 years. You always wonder, you know, how are these people getting a warm meal? How are these people getting a uh, bed to sleep at night? So, you know, I really feel strongly that we need to help these people. Over the past two years, the Community Food Bank has experienced a drastic 50% increase in the number of people seeking help. So they know that a good deed on a doorstep goes a long way in helping Rhode Islanders in need. I think people are being extra generous this year because they know that there are other families who have been in trouble and have really been... Uh, having such tough times for the past two years. Now, if the Cub Scouts and Boy Scouts weren't able to visit your neighborhood this weekend, you can still drop off food donations at Walgreens stores through November the 14th. For The Roadshow, I'm Danielle North.